Houston, the eagle has landed. Hey! This is so lustig. <laughs> So this stay here in Houston with Justin is all about childhood memories. I haven't had a taco in America since 1987. Danger Dan, I hear your tacos ready. That was some seriously good taco. <laughs> Childhood memories coming to life again. Welcome to Houston. Seems like everything's a bit bigger in the United States. Well, that shit. Is it shit if it's pink? Nah, I don't think it's shit. No, it's not shit if it's pink. It looks like shit. Nah, but it's not, it's not shit if it's pink. Mm. Definitely not. You can rent this house for $4,900 a month. What a bargain. Did I mention I love tacos? So, um, Mr. Justin, sir, w yes. what are we doing now? Find some beers, right? Beers. Um, go to the okay, here's the thing. I really love America. It's a great country. And you even, if you do it correctly, you can even find good food. But one thing is terrible, beer. And now we're going to do the only thing that's correct, buy European no, beer. No, no. German in this case. Oh, yeah. That has to be thick. Oh, yeah. Das da schmeckt sehr gut, aber es gibt sehr, sehr gute amerikanische Bier auch noch dazu. Ja? He's lying. Hey, what are you doing? Hey, good job. Uh, it's it's halftime, right? Yeah. Brady, how did you like your game? Uh, it was fun. Yeah. How many um, goals did you get? Three. Three? I mean, three goals. What made the difference today? Mm, it's because I got the support from the people who were there cheering me on. Hey, like who? Are you ready to play with the girl like, power Like, um, my dad. Are you powered up? Cool. Uh, yeah. That's good. Yeah, you Avery. always need support in life. Avery, come here. Okay. But good job. You, you did it. What did just happen? Ah! Was it your first tooth that came out? Yep. Her first you, tooth ever. You never had a tooth coming out? No. And Avery. I filmed it. Avery, do you want me to keep the tooth up I here? I filmed it. No, thank you. Can you believe it? Yeah. That's cool. Woo! Um, we're, we're watching sea perches, right? Yes. So tell me a little bit about that animal. You have to show it in the picture a little bit. So the teams design a, a underwater vehicle out of PVC pipe. You, you mean an animal, right? A sea perch? No, it's, it's, it's a... Is robot. it not an animal? No. Ah, okay. I, I thought it's an animal. Okay, good. And you have basically three motors, left, right, up and down. Okay. And it's got a wired remote and the kids have to do all of the construction and then they have to put together an engineering notebook in which they record all of their trial and errors and modifications and uh, okay. basically try to demonstrate that so, they have So what, what are the rules like to build that thing? It's got to be under $20. They have to use the motors that are provided. Okay. And that's about it. Cool. Now, it has to have zero buoyancy. It has to be able to be suspended oh, halfway okay. in the pool, right? Uh -huh. 
fine. That's, that's about it. And so you have to get uh, over an obstacle course. So the, the two as competitions fast as possible, or? It's got two different competitions. One is you have to do a navigational obstacle course that's timed. Okay. And then the second one is you have a finesse course in which you're trying to move uh, obstacles from one platform to the other. Cool. And there are different geometries, different natures. So no animals. No I learned something new. Very tough to grade. So Jackson's team really made it into the finals. They just had their interview round. And after that, um, depending on the outcome of the interview, they will be admitted to the national finals. Wow, what a day. We're keeping fingers crossed still. You think you will, you will go to the finals? No. You don't think? I mean, we have a good chance, but never yeah. know. Cool. <laughs> keeping fingers crossed for you. So wow, I have the proud honor to present to you the winning, one of the winning teams, the Electro Sharks. What do you say? What a day, huh? Yeah. What a day! Yeah, what a day! So, what, what, what were your feelings when you were standing out there? I thought, I, I thought uh, we're screwed. <laughs> But, the, but, <laughs> then, yeah, but then they called us for we hey guys, let's start with like, Will yes. and go down to Christian. third place, and then they called us, and then I thought we were so one. exciting. <laughs> it was exciting. Not all at once. It was guys, exciting just to it make it. <laughs> Will's gonna tell. Like, it was exciting I, just to make it to the presentation, but making it to nationals that was amazing. That it's the best thing that not it's one of the best things that's happened in Seaports. The best thing is the challenge and the teamwork. That's cool. That that's rad. So, um, how many teams are there admitted to the nationals? So about 400 teams have been admitted to nationals. This time. <laughs> and there's still other countries. A few other countries still. Like last year, New Zealand was there, and also some people from London were there too. Australia. Yeah, Australia. Cool. Rad. So you will be competing against 400 others, right? Yeah. Yes, sir. So what are what are you gonna do to 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 make your chances of winning? Like to max them out? We're gonna, we're gonna win, that's we'll what. Win. Yeah, but, but, but winning doesn't come without a cost, we're, right? We're gonna wake we'll everybody up at fight. night until they get a horrible sleep. We're, we're gonna, gonna make an ROV possibly, and we're just, we're gonna do it. Cool. I wish you all the luck, guys. Thank, Thank you. You Thank and your parents did an amazing what's job. Thank you. Woo! What's your name again? <laughs> <Screen. laughs> I'm Daniel. Yeah. Danger Dan. <laughs> Danger Dan, yeah. Daniel, hi. It's a pleasure to meet you guys, Everything sirs, gentlemen. Hi. <laughs> Congratulations. Are you going to post that? Huh? I'm what? Are you going to post that? Yeah, yeah, sure. Of course. Ooh, cause then of course I'm going to post that. Then we can... if, if I may. If those kids are our future, then the future is going to be brilliant. Wow. I really pull my hat, America. That's cool. That's cool. And of course, to all the parents and to all the kids and tells, wow, amazing. You do the proper work, and if you hustle enough, then you will eventually make it. I'm looking forward. Sadly, my time in Houston, Texas with Justin and his lovely family is about to end. On the other hand, I get to 
go to another city and I'm gonna accompany Justin. He's working in Austin, Texas. I heard lots of good stories about Austin. It's supposed to be a really beautiful city and I'm excited to find out myself. Of course I wouldn't leave the camera. Thank you. 